Hey guys, welcome back. So I know this is a little early to have my Christmas tree up for this. Well, maybe not. I always put my Christmas decorations up like the week of Thanksgiving. So yeah, this is the day before Thanksgiving that I'm filming this video. So if you feel like it's a little too early, I'm sorry, but I'm just kind of a Christmas freak. <laughs> but today I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my November beauty favorites. And I have a couple of things I wanna share with you guys today. I don't have like a ton of stuff. And I think I might actually throw in some food items at the end that I've been loving and I just thought I would share it with you guys. The first favorite that I wanna talk about are these Kiss Look So Natural Lashes and these are in the style Flirty. So that's what they look like. I have these lashes on today and I am in love with these. These are definitely my favorite false lashes like of the moment. I just think that these look natural but at the same time like dramatic like they make your lashes just look really full and nice another favorite of mine this past month of november were these two nyc cheek glow powder blushes that i picked up and from a distance they basically look like the same blush but they are different this one here in staten island sand is a satin mauve like dusty mauve color and the other one, which is West Side Wine, is a matte Dusty Mauve. So they are generally, whoops, I just dropped that. They are essentially the same color. It's just one is like, has a shimmer, not really a shimmer, it's like satiny. And then this one, like I said, is matte. So yeah, I've been in love with these. The This color is just so pretty, it's so versatile. This one looks super glowy on the cheek, so you don't have to necessarily use a highlight if you don't want to. And then the West Side Wine, like both of these are just such beautiful everyday blush colors. They go with like any makeup look. They're like my favorite blush color that I kind of go for, which I thought that it was going to be similar to some of the Wet n Wild color icon blushes that I have. Like this one in Rose Champagne, like I thought they were going to be similar to it, but they are a little different. This one's a little more orange and this one's a little more like mauvey pink. So yeah. The next thing that I've been in love with is, you all know how much I love my Physician's Formula Eye Booster pen, the one in Ultra Black. And I saw 11th Gorgeous, I'll link their channel down below if you guys aren't subscribed to them, but I saw that they were using a brown one. And I was like on the hunt to find it and I finally found it in deep brown, but it's so beautiful. Like it's such a nice brown color. Like probably from a distance it's gonna look black. But next to the black you can tell that it is brown, which I don't know where my black one is. Here it is. Okay, so there's the ultra black and then this is the deep brown, is that what it is? Yeah, this is the deep brown. I just love the eye booster pen. It's just so easy to use and get a nice winged eyeliner. It's a dupe for the Kat Von D tattoo eyeliner. So if you're looking for an affordable dupe to that, definitely pick these up. And I guess this is the only two colors they make is the brown and the black, but you all will have to let me know if they make other shades in these because I would definitely be interested to pick up any other shades that they make in this. The next thing that has been a huge favorite for me, I've talked about in my Bath & Body Works, like holiday, winter, Christmas, candle, body wash, hand wash, haul. Um, I hauled about this, and this is the Snowflakes and Cashmere Body Gel Body Wash. And oh my gosh, this smells so good. And I know I had one of you guys tell me that maybe it's similar to the cashmere glow and i have cashmere glow and i feel like this is different like i can see with where they're sort of similar but they're definitely different you guys need to go out to bath and body works and just smell this i think you will really like it if you like sweet fresh smelling things i love the bath and body works shower gels because they are so like just luxurious and they get super soapy and they feel you just feel really clean after you've been after you use it and they don't dry my skin out or anything like that so and the packaging on this is just super cute too it has like all this glitter and i don't know i just think it looks so pretty sitting in my bathroom speaking of bath and body works i've been in love with every single candle that i bought from bath and body works and that i showed you guys in that haul if you haven't seen that haul yet i'll link it down below because 
I didn't get a lot of views on that video. I don't know if it's because a lot of you guys don't really care about that or if maybe you didn't know that I even posted it. But if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below. But I have been in love with this Frosted Cranberry candle. It's just such a classic scent. Like I told you guys in my haul video, it reminds me of Thanksgiving and my mom because this is one of her favorite candles that she usually burns on Thanksgiving. Um, so yeah, I've been in love with this one, but honestly, I've been in love with all of them. All the candles that I picked up, I've been burning them all nonstop in my apartment. And then the last like beauty thing that I'm going to talk about before I talk about the food is the new me in... Somehow I got like dried eyelash glue on this. <laughs> I don't even want to ask myself how that happened. Okay, so yeah, the new me three in one curling wand. I got this, I got new me sent this to me a couple of years back, and I did a review on this, but I have been in love with this one, and I think this is the 25 millimeter one. It's the mid the middle one, like you get a small one a middle one and a large one. This is the mid one. And I've been loving doing these really pretty like voluminous curls with this curling iron. I just think it looks so pretty. My hair is very stick straight, doesn't hold curl very well. And this thing seriously locks in the curl. It'll last all day long and it'll even last the next day. Like I'll have to touch it up because you know, they'll get kind of, the curls get messed up when you sleep on it. But yeah, I mean, if you have very sick straight hair that doesn't hold curl, I highly recommend this new me 3-in-1, about hit myself right in the head, 3-in-1 <laughs> curling wand. And this, with it being 3-in-1, like they detach off and you could put like the smaller one, the larger one, and then this medium one on there. So if you want to know more about that, I'll link my video where I did the review on that. Like it was a couple of years back I did the review. So I'm going to go to the kitchen and get the food products that I was going to mention that were my favorites this month. Okay, I've been in love with these Jiffy Pop things. Like, I know these things are super old school, but Josh and I, we've been having so much fun, like, popping popcorn with this. And then we found these flavorings, which I think are so cool to put on popcorn. They're called Kernel Seasonings, and this is cheesy caramel corn. And then we also have the kettle corn. And then we also have the white cheddar, which I'm not really the biggest fan of the white cheddar of, in these, but I love the cheesy caramel corn. Like it tastes like caramel, like like salty and caramel popcorn. And then the kettle corn, it's just so good on like buttered popcorn. Like it tastes straight up like kettle corn whenever you use this. Like it gives the popcorn like a really sweet taste. So yeah, I've really been liking these. They're just like little seasonings that you just sprinkle on your popcorn once it pops. Um, and I know that they have a bunch of other flavors in these, so I want to pick up some other ones and try them out. So yeah, been in love with those things. And then this is just so, so random, but I just wanted to show it. So I've been in love with these jalapeno string cheese sticks. They're just string cheese with jalapeno and red bell peppers. And I think it's with um, mozzarella cheese. So yeah, I've been in love with these. These are the Kroger brand, which if you have a Kroger near you, you can pick them up. Um, but I'm sure that other brands make these, but there's just something about the jalapeno, like the pepper jack type of thing in the cheese. It just, it's so good. I don't know. I've just been in love with that. So those are like my random food favorites of the month. You guys will have to let me know if you like me throwing in random favorites like that. Um, I know that you guys like it when I throw in like fashion favorites and stuff like that, which this shirt that I have on is a favorite of mine. I think it's so pretty. I'm going to wear this for Christmas this year. So, and I do have a makeup tutorial coming up on this. It's probably going to be a little ways before I post it. This is going to be like a glittery glam Christmas makeup tutorial. So, yeah. I don't know if my lights were too bright the whole time I was filming. If they were, I apologize. I'm so bad about that. Um, so yeah, I hope that you guys did enjoy this favorites video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up or let me know down in the comments and let me know down in the comments what have been some of your favorites for this month of November, whether it be food or makeup or whatever, just let me know. I hope that you all have a great day and have a great awesome month of December. I have a lot of fun videos coming up for this month of December. So yeah, I cannot wait to post them. So if you want to watch my last video that I posted, I'll just 
just have that linked right there so you can just click on it and if you are new to my channel and want to subscribe just click on my little face right there and you can subscribe to my beauty channel i will see you guys in my next video and i hope that you all have an awesome day bye bye Mwah.